New op pack in the air, this gas or what? He'll still be a laugh right now if you niggas ain't gas him up. So, I'm gonna be showing y'all how to do my slick back. You're gonna need scrunchies for like section, wide tooth comb, edge brush if you feel like you need it, a diamond brush, a bristle brush soft or regular and like a harder one if you feel like you need it, edge control, leave-in conditioner, oil, and all your gels. I'm gonna be using this to slick my ponytail and if I feel like I need to, I'll put this on my ponytail to like curl it up. I start by making my part. Oh, and I forgot, you need water. Oh, I look so crazy, y'all. Bear with me, though. Bear with me, though. All right, water bottle. split it in a section, take the sides, split them into their own sections, and then after that you're left with the back, so I split my back into two, one, two, because I have really thick hair. So, yeah. You start off by wetting the hair. It does get messy and drippy and stuff, so I put on a t-shirt I didn't really care about. Wet your hair and then put some moisturizer in here. I just get enough to where I can spread it all over my hands like this and focus more on my ends, but I try to get it all over my hair. So this is like the base of your ponytail. I detangle with my wide tube comb just in case so that when I go through with the dead man brush, it doesn't rip out my hair. Then after I do that, I just put a little bit of olive oil on the strands. That just pretty much seals in the moisture. And get your hair nice and shiny. Okay, so now I take the olive oil eco styler. You don't have to use a lot of gel. I mean, hey, I got thick hair. And if you want a slicky slick, sometimes you gotta use a lot. So I basically first when I'm in the back, I just focus the gel more on the, not the roots, but I guess you could say the roots, you know, like that. And then I take the dimming brush and start at the ends and then go up to the roots and come through the gel. And this is the part that's gonna get your hair slick, brushing it out with the dimming brush or smoothing it out with the dimming brush. Once you feel like it's nice and combed out, take your um, take a scrunchie you don't care about. Take the scrunchie that you're not going to use and add your ponytail, and just tie this up and bend like that. You did one swing, and you do this to all your sections. Alrighty, got the back done with these sections as you do with the others. Only thing different is that you're using a rat tail. Then I apply my gel, focus it on the roots. You can smooth it with your fingers first if you got two, two. Then you wanna take the rat tail and start from the bottom, of course, so you're not ripping out your freaking hair. Then, slick. You get me? Slick it back. Ugh. You feel me? 
just like that so it can lay like that yeah so I'm on the other side and you do the same thing I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm tired y'all I don't really know how to explain it you know there's not really much to it once I showed y'all the first time you know it's the same thing over and over again except for at the top you're just adding an extra step with the rat tail so you can get that, that slickness that slick back you know a pet name slick back <laughs> oh my god it's you bruh bruh if I could just y'all see them waves dog don't play with me y'all keep playing with me y'all little boys y'all put on y'all do red brush y'all hair a couple times and think y'all swimming I've been doing this since birth. It's man. Stop playing with me, man. Add your gel, you're Add your gel. You feel me? Get it nice and slicked on there, you're Slick it with your fingers, your hands, whatever. You know, just get a nice little base of gel on that joint. Slick it back, slick it back, slick it, slick it, slick it, slick it. it. Mm. 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 Uh, uh. <laughs> I gotta go to sleep right now. She just keep texting me, bruh. What I get, what I get, what I get. I got the same thing over and over and over and over. Just like this hair tutorial. Same thing over and over and over. Oh. <laughs> swoop it to like uh, curve it when you slick it if y'all get what I'm saying if y'all catch my drift like swoop like that like that yeah yeah just like that make sure behind your air is always cool make it nice and neat so you don't have no hair kicked up behind there. Take the ponytail and add that section as well. You're almost there, girl. Don't give up now. You done made it this far. <laughs> okay. So, like all the other sections, moisturize, oil, detangle, detangle, gel, slick. But I'm going to stick up. I'm going to skip straight to the slick part because I'm going to moisturize and detangle and then split this in sections. Is not that long to just be yummy. I want to make sure that everything slicks down and gets into the ponytail. So.
finish all that, fix up your edges if you got to, finish, you know, do your touch up brushing, take and put everything in the ponytail, put your scarf on, call it a night. Then in the morning, if you feel like you got to, spritz your ponytail with water, put some conditioner or leave-in conditioner in it, put some, uh, if you have to and your front is popping up a little bit, take some edge control. Don't do what I'm doing. Soon as you're done, sis, pull on that scarf because <laughs> follow me on social media so y'all can keep up with me outside of YouTube. And yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for being so patient with me. Good luck with your slick backs. And yeah. Every chain at least a dub. Uh, a dub. Yeah. Yeah. Walking in, I make it flood. Duh. In the club, I got my slug. With some fucking blood, duh. Yeah, they show me love. Uh, nigga, you a scrub, but you thought, ho.